hello everyone i'm back with another video so if you have a dual boot system and dual boot menu is not showing at the time of starting up your pc then this video is for you hey in this video we are going to discuss how we can fix a dual boot menu not showing in windows 11 so that's been said let's get started say for example you have installed two operating system on your pc one is windows 11 as a default operating system and say for example another one is ubuntu now you are not getting a boot menu when you start up your windows 11 to select your operating system in this situation you have to enable dual boot menu on your default operating system that is windows 11 to do so simply open comment prom here on the search option search for cmd and here you will find comment prom application open this application as an administrator so here we have our comment prom as an administrator here simply run one command so don't worry about this command, I'll put this command in the description box. After that simply hit enter and if you find the operation complete successful that means dual boot menu has been enabled on your windows 11. Now every time you start up your system you will find a dual boot menu option from where you can select a operating system you want to boot in. There is also another way to select your default operating system on your boot menu. For that you have to open setting application here go to system and look for about option here you'll find advanced system settings simply click on this option so here we have our system property window let me minimize this window here you'll find one option called startup and recovery here simply click on this settings option and here you have startup and recovery option from here you can select your default operating system from the drop down menu. You can also set a time limit if no operating system is selected on your boot menu it will automatically boot the default operating system after this time limit. To save the settings simply click on ok and restart your computer to see the changes. These are the few tips you can use to fix dual boot option on your windows 11. So that's it for this video. Hope this video was helpful to you. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Bye for now. See you next video.